Hi, it's John here. Uh, today is Monday, the uh, 29th of August 2016. I'm back from the East Coast, from Port Awanui, uh, east of Rutura, 16 kilometres or so. And I'm just about to ring Elizabeth Hauruga for the land block at Port Awanui. Here goes. Oh, nobody. Yes, uh, Elizabeth, John One Eye here in Auckland. Um, just calling about the heading at A10 block. I'm just looking at it online now. That's the one I, I really wanted um, as well as the uh, other one, the A12. Um, so put me in for the package for that one, please. I see that it's available now. Um, and um, so uh, that one's more suited to me. Uh, even though we'll uh, have the other one as well, uh, but this one here is more, more, more where I'm wanting to go. Um, so uh, give me a call, and we'll talk about that one too. Thank you. Bye, John. One hour. There, I just left a message for Elizabeth for the meeting for heading at A10. I'm picking these for a reason. It's because I want to do the Renfilly Bank Tidal Energy Project. And so these will suit me and our project planning uh, to develop with machines and whatnot to fit in there in, on the block. Uh, so we'll wait, I can't wait, but we'll wait for a call from her and to see how we are going with the hearing a 12 block. Um, I've been talking with um, Iru Painga and his son um, on Te Horo Marae and also um, Boyce, um, Boyce, um, Boyce, he, uh, Tomorrow. And his brother, Bill, and his wife, Kevin. So, I got on alright with them, Bill and Carol, that's right. So I wanted to have more talk with Bill, but he seems to have missed out on having some more talk. But next time we'll have some talk, me and him, uh, in a quiet little corner because I'm sure he has a lot to say. Um, so, uh, they are more concerned about um, the boundary lines uh, on the Tikapa side and where it's all been split out from their Tukuna's lands. Now, I'm there to dis 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 disseminate one piece of land from another um, in the right sense of the original titles, native titles, that's before the British came here. I'll know which ones are which. I've had plenty of time with the customary native titles, um, akin to the original surnames of the land. So that's some part of what I want to do there. But I'm more passionate about getting on the land, a piece of land at least. Um, all my struggles. It's been 20 years since I've been able to actually get on a piece of land or marry uh, a 
multi ownership lands. If somebody else has already got it, be ahead of me, either because they were very smart at getting it, but couldn't do much more than what it looks like now. Wreck to bits in some parts of erosion and um, um, other parts of the property where the big trees have gone and it's clear felled and got uh, animals on mostly sheep and cattle which is adding to the economy or, or creating an income so we still have to prove ourselves by having an income I wanted to put a quarry there and use the soil that's going into the sea and be wasted so that's my engineering feat uh, apart from the tidal turbines on the Brandfully Bank. Now that we've got clearance from the Marae, go ahead, go and pick a piece of land and do something. There, that's what that was all about. So I have to go ahead and do things myself now because I can't really rely on anyone anymore after what happened on the Marae. Unfortunate. I really had a, I wish I had a crowd, but it doesn't matter because they don't know what this is. Only the people online that look at it can see it's a big pipe dream. So that's what the impression is, a big pipe dream. Rome wasn't built, built in a day, and neither was this country. It took time. It took at least 182 years to get this far with this flag. See? And we haven't done much with this flag, with building anything. This is the first time this flag will ever have the authority that it has higher than any other authority in the world of a king. The first piece of soil that we're going to put our foot in. That's what, <coughs> that's what uh, Boise says. Timaru. That's uh, Tama Timaru's family. King Itaudua's friends. He says, oh, as long as there's a crack on the land you can put your foot in. That's what's going to happen. I'll put the foot in the crack, prise it open and make sure I go deep enough with my foot so I don't leave. Right? That's what's going to happen. That's the way he's talking. And he's on the other side in Te Kapa, and we're on this side in Te Horo. So I got a good feel for them, the old guys, and uh, Ili Painga, and his son, Rongapai. Um, I got his name wrong. I was calling him Huriho. I don't know where that one came from, so I gave him a name, Woody Hope. Uh, it hasn't stuck really, but might, might stick. But I'm just about to see in the minutes to uh, um, uh, oh, Lillian Bowen, the secretary there, the Marae. I'm going to work in with them because I'm not going to leave responsibility like this to anybody else but those people on the Marae who are organising things the way I see it on first contact. So that's how it looks and I just wanted to, I've been looking at the map of the area and I'm just trying to think who's going to go there and do all the work for me. So I'm looking for contractors, people who know what they're doing. I'm not going to muck around and try and think that any body can pick something up and do it. Not this sort of work. Not this sort of work. I don't propose to put anybody there that's not proficient enough to do the whole job, one shot. We're very quick at what we do it, it, and, and, and it has to be right because we're going a long way with this project. We're going a long way with the shares. I'm getting on to it tomorrow after I clear these things up today in the videos and um, get on with it and get my minutes in first to the committee then I have a good relationship with the marae of anything that goes on there will go through that marae everything, business, the lot I'll rely on Iru I'm happy with him and his son to look after things for me because I need pretty good reliable people that can talk uh, from long-standing um, um, management and also knowledge. 
they're in the mug. So that's all that matters. I get on with them, and the internet works there. On that my eyes, I just have to take some good gear back and boost it up so it can go fast and operate very quickly. So with that, I'm just waiting for Elizabeth to give me a call back from Tetumutu Mubairo with this lease and get in going. The A10, heading A10 block, I'm going to put in for that one too. And um, Richard and Leslie are on the A11 block. Um, so I'm looking at um, using that worst part of erosion that's falling into the sea. I'm hoping that I can cut that out of the block. He says it's a good idea. That will relieve him of some of the costs of erosion control. If we can cut the hill down to stop more pulling the hill in and use some of the resources to uh, hold it back. I'm talking about concrete, cement, concrete and reinforcing of what we're doing in our business. Okay, so that's all. That's all I really want to say uh, for now. Then I thought I might get her on the phone and call her, but anyway, we'll leave it at that and I'll get on with it. Uh, so I got home safely from the East Coast, although it was a, the last bit was hard driving uh, back uh, through Hamilton and up to Auckland. It's been raining, uh, and but however, the old car got there and back all right, and I managed to not hit a cow on the road coming through the gorge, uh, coming around through the East Cape, Tika and that. The cows uh, seem to graze on the road a lot, as being grass on the road. Uh, okay, um, so I can't think of anything else at this stage, other than to progress towards the date of uh, the hui, uh, 19th of September, at 3 o'clock on Monday. Um, for the land block I want. Okay, and the other one is, I'll just forget what the time of that one is. One is on the 19th of September, that's that one. 19th of September. That one is the 19th, yeah, that's it. That's that one. And the other one is. Oh. Anyway, the A12 is on some some day. I've got to be somewhere, but anyway, that's all for now. We'll catch you later. Bye for now.